and don't forget about those uh, papers for next time, all right? <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Are you okay, Ashley? Um, you know, if you need someone to talk to, I'm, I'm here for you. I'll see you back at the apartment, Ashley. Bye, John. Listen, um, you don't have to go through this alone. You know that, right? I know you've had a rather rough time. Changing my major from religious studies. But you're doing so well here. I just don't see the point anymore. I don't feel his presence anymore, and I can't stand staying at a religious school anymore. Well, remember Matthew 14, 31. Huh? Jesus reached out his hand and held him, saying, why did you doubt? Jesus had doubts. I know he did. On the crucifixion, he asked, Oh, Father, why have you forsaken me? <laughs> well, I mean, it was, it was more like a, Oh, why have you forsaken me? <laughs> so, uh, Jesus joke. Yes, never mind. Anyway, the point is that we all have our doubts. It's these trying times that reaffirm our faith. We may think that it's too late, or we, sometimes we think that uh, we want something else to believe in. I know. I've been there. Listen, I, I know you think this is what you want. Take your time, okay, as much as you need. Think it through. Thank you. Maybe you could do the same.
listening. You? What are you doing? What about God? It looks like we finally made a believer out of you. What about faith? The best wolves hide as sheep in the flock. You think I give a shit about God or the devil? Why me? Why Carrie? She... She lusted after the flesh. Once I got done with her, she got what she asked for. Her screams were beautiful, divine. Your screams combined will be a symphony. Just let go. Just let go. It's gonna be beautiful. Just let go. Just let go. Oh, it's gonna be beautiful. I just wanna see your insides. 